Hello students, I'm taking one of the typical questions in bipods. So otherwise bipods is very simple, but sometimes it becomes difficult to set the approach of the question. So we're taking one such question. Evaluate. Now in this question though, best approach will be to put tan inverse x is equal to t or x is equal to tan t which is one and the same thing. So we put tan inverse of x is equal to t but why are we putting this? Because the derivative of tan inverse x is dx upon 1 plus x square and the other side will be dt. So this can take the entire of the denominator. So this dx upon 1 plus x square will be converted to dt. And secondly, we can put x in terms of tan t. So both the methods are right if you put tan inverse x is equal to t or if you put x is equal to tan t. Now it's time to substitute. This dx over 1 plus x square can be replaced with dt. This tan inverse x will surely be t and every x will be tan t. So this is e to the power t, 1 plus tan t, tan square t dt. Now you can combine 1 plus tan square t and this is e to the power t tan t plus secant square t dt. You may use the direct formula that if we have e to the power x and we have function with its derivative then we can write the direct answer as ex fx plus c and in this case you have to only explain now what is uh, fx and what is its derivative so you can do this also along with you can open the bracket and since secant square t is the derivative of tan t so you open this as biparts so by expanding this as biparts, you're right. First function tan t as it is, integration of et is et minus the whole integration of derivative of tan t is secant square t into the integration of et is et dt. And you can see that now we have additive inverse, so the two will be cancelled and we are left with et tan t. Since the question is in x, so we need to get the final answer in terms of x. If you remember, t was tan inverse x and tan t was x. So now the answer comes as x in place of tan t and e to the power tan inverse of x in place of this t. So the final answer is x into e to the power tan inverse of x plus c. So by appropriate approach, you can crack the typical questions.